Hi guys, welcome to my kitchen. Today I'm making pan seared haddock with fried rosemary and garlic in the Copper Chef XL. Okay, I'm starting out here with some haddock fillets that I seasoned with salt, pepper, and paprika on both sides. I'm going to set them aside just for now. Okay, now I have my Copper Chef XL pan here heating up over medium heat. I'm going to put some olive oil in here. Put about four to five tablespoons in there. Now I have six cloves of garlic that I sliced thin and six sprigs of fresh rosemary. We're going to get this in here and fry them over medium heat so the garlic starts to turn brown and the rosemary sprigs start to uh, brown up as well. Okay, now that my garlic and rosemary is fried and that will serve two purposes. It will not only act as a garnish on top of the fish but it helped infuse this oil with its flavor. I might pants it on medium. Now my fish I have three or four fairly large or fairly thick pieces of fish. I'm going to fry them together because they're going to take a little longer. And then I have three pieces that are fairly thin. I'll fry them next so they're going to fry quicker so I get a more consistent fry on the fish. And I'm just going to swirl my oil around here. So I'm going to do this for about four minutes on each side. Okay, my fish is done frying on one side. I've tried to bring you guys back so let's see how this turns over. Let's get a nice uh, sear on it. And I did five minutes on the one side. I'm going to do five minutes on the second side to make sure that's completely cooked through. Okay, my fish is all done frying. Let's go ahead and fix it for plate and see what we got. Okay, I went ahead and garnished the fish with that rosemary and garlic that we fried. Let me get in here and get a taste of this fish, guys. It's nice and flaky. has really good flavor. That garlic and rosemary really does it. Okay, there you have it. Pan seared haddock with fried rosemary and garlic in the Copper Chef XL. Give this a try. Thanks for watching. And until next time, I'll see ya.